A number of changes have been made to the way we tick our evaluation options inside FeatureCam. Initially you will notice that if I am a trial user and I don't have a dongle, I choose No. I get to the next screen and this allows me to choose the options that I wish to evaluate. Now in previous versions of FeatureCam we only had the 2.5D milling checked. Um, this didn't really provide enough functionality for a trial user to really get a handle on what the product was capable of. So we've now introduced a number of additional default options so that you get a bit more of a feel of the product. Once I've selected that I can choose Next and Finish. If I cancel my new part document wizard and just go to my file evaluation options, you'll notice that it is telling me that FeatureCam is running in evaluation mode because there is no valid dongle or network license. You will be unable to post or save files. I can, however, choose different options here if I want to evaluate additional elements within the product. This is done by simply ticking the options that I want and saying apply. However, if we have a valid network license or a valid path and dongle, we can go ahead and use the options uh, derived exactly from our license interrogation. Let's have a look at this by exiting the program and this time plugging in my dongle. With an active network license or a valid path and dongle, I can go to my file evaluation options and I have two new radio buttons that I can select. In the first instance, if I choose Activate All Available Products on My License, you'll notice it will indicate which are licensed and all of the checkboxes become greyed out. This makes it much easier for a new user with a valid license to enable all their product options that they've paid for. We can also manually select components if we wish to evaluate additional options or if we went to minimize the product and just use the options for a particular process or sequence. Once I've done that I can say apply and you'll notice the license checkboxes will disappear. To return back to my license I can simply click on the radio button for activate all my available products and this will interrogate the license system again and give me all the options that I have available to me. I can now apply and accept that and start running the program.